as you mentioned a little bit there, as people wake up this morning, we've learned more about President Trump pardoning and commuting sentences for more than 140 people overnight. Deanna, there was a lot of speculation about who could be on this list. That's right, Adrian. In the final moments of his presidency, President Donald Trump offered clemency to a variety of individuals ranging from politicians to rappers. Now, that list includes Trump's one-time political strategist, Stephen Bannon. Bannon pleaded not guilty to charges he defrauded people who donated to a We Build the Wall online fundraising campaign. President Trump also pardoned Elliot Broidy, the former deputy finance chair of the Republican National Committee. Committee, excuse me, He pleaded guilty last fall in a lobbying scheme to drop a Malaysian wealth fund investigation. Rapper Lil Wayne also received a pardon. He had pleaded guilty to possession of a firearm and ammunition by a convicted felon. Now, despite several pleas to the president, a social media petition, Tiger King's Joe Exotic will remain behind bars on murder for hire charges. The Netflix star felt so confident that he would be released that he booked a limo to pick him up from his attorney's office. The president also did not pardon himself, his family, or his personal lawyer, Rudy Giuliani. Adrian. Okay, that List coming out overnight. Tiana, thank you.